have a system 3x minus 2y equals 8 minus 3x plus 2y equals negative 4. This is a very simple situation in terms of using the addition principle because I have opposite coefficients. So when I have opposite coefficients, all I need to do is add the two equations together. And then the second equation is going to, the variable is going to drop out. One variable will drop out. So I'm adding these two. And what I'll see is I had 3x minus 3x. Great, that drops out. I have 0. Well, I also actually had opposite coefficients for the y's. So I had two sets of opposite coefficients here, and you know what's going to happen? The y's going to drop out as well. So now I have 0 and 0 equals 4, or 0 equals 4. But we know that 0 doesn't equal 4. This is that situation that I described in a previous lecture where I have a constant, where I end up with something that says c equals d, that's saying one constant equals another constant. But since that is not true, what I have is no solution. There is no solution for this system of equations. And I looked here, I may have seen right away that I actually had two opposite coefficients. Two, both variables had opposite coefficients. And when I combine those two equations, when I add them, I'm going to end up with both x and y dropping out, which gives me 0, zero equals 4, which is not true. Today on Educator.com, we discuss solving systems of equations through addition and subtraction. Next time, we'll be doing another method for solving systems of equations.